Rebecca, also known as Four Kids at One Four Seven, and I've just sort of started working on um, the round versus square canvases. So I've just made a little start on the round um, with sort of some beginner's tips on a beginner's video. And I sort of noticed how, how much clearer the bee looked on the round canvas. So I thought, do you know what, before I get any more finished, um, I need to sort of do a comparison before I even start on the canvases. So I'm going to be very brave and I'm actually going to take these all the way off. So let's put the square to that side and let's put the round to the other side. Um, but they are both the same image. They're printed the opposite way up to each other. So I'm just sort of doing a, a little bit of, of a couple of comparisons before I get them done. Um, and I may well put the videos together. We'll see. We'll see how long this one ends up. Um, it may go up as a comparison before I get them done. But what, what's quite surprising is they're both 30 colours. They are both 30 colours. However, the numbers, the symbol numbers are different. And the canvases look completely different. Now, I know with the round, they have to have a truer colour on the background because of the gaps that you find. But even the number of the background is different. So on the round canvas, it is not DMC number 819. And on the square canvas, a lot of this background is actually 3865 mixed in with 3866. Whereas on this one, all this section around the top, which is what I'm working at the moment, all that is 819. Whereas this is more 3866 with a bit of 3865 mixed in. So found quite a few changes on the canvas before I've even started. Um, I did have a count up of the numbers. Now, I didn't count all the way across and all the way down. Maybe I should. Maybe it would have been easier. What I did was on the colour list that um, who it can give you, it tells you the quantity that you'll need of each colour. I added those up. So I added those up for round, which is on the left, and square, which is on the right. For round, there is 6,160 diamonds it says we need and for square there is 7644 so square is smaller than round which was sort of known anyway but it's definitely clearer now but just to lift up the square one so you can see you can hardly see the sort of B image uh, and the flowers, normally they can be seen a little bit better um, on camera than they can when you're looking at it with with your eyes, <laughs> when you're looking at it with it in front of you, but it's not major clear. Now, there are a few symbols in the middle of the B that are white based. So while it's a black symbol, it's then got a solid white on the top of it. Whereas with the round, while they've got white in the middle, they've got a lot more black around the outside because, of course, you're placing the diamonds on the top. So that may be why that the canvas for the round looks a lot more like the image than the square does. Because with the square, you're placing the diamonds all the way over the top. With the round, you're going to see some of the edges. So that's sort of a comparison I thought I'd show you. Um, just to get this covered up again hmm this should be fun shouldn't it uh, let's just get this covered up again as, as best as I can um, and I will show you the difference in the colour key between the two of them so I know that piece goes that way because I've started working on it I've folded it back so let's pop that one on that side Okay, so to show you the colour list, let me get them both the right way around. In fact, let's zoom in. 
I should use my zoom more. It saves my hands. There we go. So let's zoom in for you. So the colour list, the first colour on the round of 150 isn't in the square. 168 is in both. Uh, then we've got 223 that's in the square but not in the round. Um, 301's in both, 310's in both. But even the likes of the 310, there is 66 in one of them and 126 in the other. And the 126 is in the round that has less diamonds overall than the square does. Who knows? So it will be fun to have a look and see, you know, what these are both like when they're completed. But at the moment, the big difference is, is the backgrounds are two different DMC colours on each painting. Um, of course, the numbers, which we'd expect the square has more than the round. Um, but overall, the square colours seem to, to have a few that are a little bit brighter so 961 is a little bit brighter um, though having said that that could be the canvas so 3328 looks darker on the round canvas than it does on the square canvas maybe it's just the way the symbol lies on the top of it that makes it look a little bit different but we've got none of these 3865 and 3866 they don't even exist on this painting and in turn 819 which is the big amount round the outside doesn't exist on this painting so it'll be quite interesting to see if there is an overall colour scheme that's that's a little bit different on the round versus the square when it's completed but I thought I'd show you quickly what the two different canvases look like they're both exactly the same size they're both 20 by 50 um, they both have the same code for the picture 9539 but one is MV and one is FV and that is the only difference apart from of course the drastic differences in the canvas in the fact that you can clearly see the image on that one but not as much on this one. And in fact, that B is now upside down. So, <laughs> and the canvases are printed the opposite way around, but hey ho. <laughs> um, but to look at the B, you can hardly see the B in this one, but yeah, you can clearly see it in this one. And this one has got less diamonds than this one. So, what's your thoughts? Um, this will be a fun comparison. It's not like it's two different sellers either. They're both the same seller. So it will be fun to see what these two look at look like. Um, I am going to try and get them done as soon as I can. Um, but I do have a lot of paintings to do at the moment. So um, we'll see how quickly I can get them done. But um, yeah, I thought I'd just show you a quick comparison before we really get stuck in. And then we'll have a comparison once we're all done. So thanks for watching and I'll speak to you all again soon.